Hey guys, and welcome back to your girl's channel, okay, period. Welcome back to Lonnie's World, okay? So, in today's video, what I am bringing to y'all is a eyebrow tutorial. Now, this isn't just any eyebrow tutorial. This is a Audrey Hepburn inspired brow. So, Audrey Hepburn, she's the blueprint. I'm pretty sure the blueprint for this brow. Um, we also have Ariana Grande, Bella Hadid, like people that I'm naming, you guys know their brows are like, it's just completely straight. Also my mom rocks these type of brows too, cause she doesn't have eyebrows, so she just draws her brows on. So she rocks this brow shape too. So drum roll please. I'm going to be recreating this brow look as well. But since I have brows, I am not going to be shaving my brows off because to just grow them to be thick enough, it took a while because I was a victim of the 2000 brows where I over plucked and they were extremely thin. And thin brows are cute for some people. Yes, they can rock them and they look cute, but for me, they do not go with my face shape. So my brows are perfect, perfect the way they are. And yes, I'll probably do like a brow tutorial or like a follow up or whatever, cause my brows are pretty like, I haven't like plucked them or whatever, but I'll probably do like a tutorial on how I achieve like my nice clean brows when it's time to just, you know, maintenance and like touch them up. But without further being said, we are going to get right into this video, okay guys? And I'm kind of nervous, so I want y'all to rock with me and stay tuned for this because I've never done this before and I'm like kind of nervous and like geeking out. But I'm gonna pull up a picture of like the brow that I'm going to do. I might insert it in the video or whatever and we're gonna see if I can recreate it and bring it to life, okay? Period. Let's get right on into this video, honey. Okay, guys, so the camera might be in a little, um, it's gonna be zoomed in at this point. So yeah, you guys are probably really zooming in on my face and everything. So first things first, we're just going to take our paper towel and just make sure we're wiping off any excess oils on our brow. Honestly, guys, like I haven't watched a tutorial on how to do this, so I'm just kind of winging it. I've seen like drag queens and stuff like that do their brows, like how they draw it on. So I'm kind of just going off memory. I probably should have watched a video on this, but whatever. Also, I'm backing up because I feel like you guys are like extremely close to my face and it's kind of disgusting. Um, so I do have like my little mirror. You guys should be able to see me, but looking at my eyebrows, like I probably should have plucked, but whatever. I'm using this Elmer's washable glue stick, color purple. Just like that, we're gonna roll this bad boy up and we're just going to place this straight onto our eyebrows. Wait a second. Huh? Is she with you? Mm -hmm. And I think I've heard like when people are saying like when this is like drying and stuff like that, um, I think you wanna like brush the hair up while it's drying. I really don't know. Like <laughs> when I tell you, like I'm just going like fly by the seat of my pants type of thing doing this. Like I so, I swear I really am. And I feel like you have to do this like a couple of times, like a couple of different layers.
so basically you want this just to dry and like dry clear or whatever we might do another layer but you want it basically to be extremely like flat to your face that's i guess like that's the technique from what i've seen you want to have it like really neat and you don't want it to be too gunky and you want it to like just dry kind of flat so that when we go in to like cover up our brow um it's covered and everything okay so you guys are seeing the brows and they look pretty pretty um clear right anything clear okay so i might zoom in a little bit more on this so you guys can see what i'm doing or maybe not i don't know because i feel like you guys are in enough but now i'm basically going to be going in with uh, my born this way highlighter i really didn't want to go in with like any of like my nice makeup products but then i'm like you know what if we're gonna do this we might as well go all out so we're gonna take this and we're just oh wait no i'm cutting that out we're not going in with concealer we're going in with my foundation so we're going in with my bobby brown um foundation and this is in the color golden okay so we're gonna take this and we're just going to place it right on my um brow you don't want to move you don't want to like rupture the um glue so you want to like do this like as like best as you can i guess um i don't know if they put powder on first to like set it do they put powder on first? Y'all, I really don't know if they put powder on first. You know what? We're gonna do a little bit of powder first. A little bit of powder just so that it sets. Like, I don't even know if I'm doing this right, guys. I'm probably like, no, don't put powder on. It's okay though. We're gonna put powder on and then we're gonna do our coat of foundation on top. And then, um, then we're gonna do another la layer of powder and we should be good. Okay. Guys, like, I haven't even, like, got anywhere, and I'm, like, already, like, freaking out. I'm, like, holy crap. This is crazy. Okay, so we're just going to take our um, beauty blender. We're just going to take our foundation, and we're going to squirt, 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 squirt on top of our blender. And we're going to just place it on top. <laughs> Guys, I'm, like, freaking out. Okay, we're going to place it on top. And, ooh, do I have to do, do I have to do makeup on my whole face to do this? I really don't want to. That's a lot of foundation I just put on top. Do another coat of um, because I'm looking at all sorts of crazy right now. I'm gonna do another coat of foundation on top of my eyebrows. Okay, 
Um, and you guys can see like where like the makeup is kind of like catching on because like the glue and stuff like that. We're just gonna do another coat. Mm -hmm. coat. On the eyebrow. I'm gonna edit. Can show me. I'm gonna show. I'll edit some meat. Are you gonna show me? Alright. So we're gonna take our beauty blender, some more, and we're just going to We're gonna blend blend lightly blend, blend this. Cause like I said guys, we want the illusion of no hair. And I think from like doing this, like obviously I'll try it again. Like I wanna do like drag makeup next, but I feel like the more glue, like once you have like, you know what they say about makeup? When you have like a nice base, like when you have like a sturdy base, your base, when your base is like good, then your makeup comes out flawless. Like. It's kind of like with like the brows, like if you have like enough glue and it's dried and everything and it's like transparent, that's like your base and it's good. Or I also could just not know what I'm talking about and just be being a bunch of mess. You know, that also works too. I don't know. Can you guys like tell? I don't think I can tell. My hairs are kind of dark. I can still like see them peeking through. I don't know if you guys can tell. Okay. Okay, team. Okay, you guys are up close and personal still with me. Um. Hmm. Because I can still see it. <gasps> Ooh, what if we put some concealer on it? The color. Concealer. A little bit of concealer. You guys are probably like, Ani, what are you doing? I'm trying to, I don't, I didn't bring like all my makeup out here with me. So I'm trying to like color correct so you guys can't see the darkness before like I go ahead and like set it with powder. You know what I'm flinging? Because once you go ahead and set with powder, like that's pretty much it. Does that like highlight it and bring it more to noticeable? You know what? Forget it. We can't, we don't have time for this. We're gonna set it. Because I don't know, I would have to like really like color correct this and I don't wanna keep touching it to make it rupture. Okay. Oh, I didn't tell you what I'm baking with. So I'm baking with the air spun powder. And I guess you really wanna like press that in there. Yeah. We're gonna save this, don't worry guys. On this channel, we mess up, but we're gonna save it. I should go ahead and bake the rest of my face, huh? Okay, and we're back. So 
We're just going to wipe off the remaining powder on the rest of our face. I agree, powdered our face. Okay. And this is like a horrible app makeup application on my face. But I really didn't think I was going to... I really didn't think I was going to need it on my face, but... We're gonna go ahead and wipe that off. That excess powder off the brows. And then... What we're going to do is... So that it's not like a white cast. We're gonna take our MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. And this is in the color dark, okay? And I'm going to take it and I'm going to just press it. And then I'm gonna press that into my eyebrow area so that it looks more like a skin finish. I feel like this is what's really gonna like save it. Is that, that, that. I will say it's pretty weird. It's almost like I need like full cover. I think I know why it's coming out kind of weird. It's because I'm not using full coverage foundation. Although Bobbi Brown is full coverage. I mean, how do you guys think about it? Like far away, it's not that bad. It definitely looks like something's going on. I will say this much. I should have grabbed like my Huda Beauty full coverage because I don't really like have too many full coverage, but I would say Huda Beauty is pretty full coverage. It looks like I have some type of eczema or like underlying skin condition like this. Okay, so we're just moving on. Okay, because I cannot with this. This might be a fail, this might not, we will see. So now we're going off the Anastasia Brow Definer. Okay. And this is the part we're drawing on our fake brows. Okay, I probably should have got use my dip, my pomade, but whatever, you know, you live and you learn these type of things. So I'm going to, okay, so I'm gonna take it. This is in the color dark brown. I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna just draw.
All right, now what we're going to do is we're going to go in with our concealer. Okay, this is the Born This Way. It's warm beige. We're gonna take our um, eyebrow brush or whatever. And we're going to conceal these brows. And we're gonna go back in after we conceal and like fix whatever we need to fix, okay? Ooh, okay, this brow is actually looking good. It's coming out like how I kind of planned, yes. I love it. Okay, we're just gonna go clean it up some more. Guys, this eyebrow is giving what it's supposed to get. Okay, period. Now, we're going to fix it up before we conceal the other eyebrow. We're gonna sharpen it. Sharpen this tail, honey, period. Okay, that tail is looking sharp. And we're gonna conceal the top part of the brow. Obviously, I didn't blend out the top, but honey, this brow though, I'm liking it. It's looking horrible and cakey with the makeup, but I'm liking this brow. Okay guys, so this is the finished product of the brows. Um, pretty much I didn't blend the top or whatever. I can just cover that up with like some powder, hopefully. Um, but yeah, this is pretty much the finished look with the brows. Um, The brows are giving what they were supposed to give, and I'll tell you why. Because first, excuse me, because for, it's giving what it's supposed to give. Because I'll tell you why. First off, I'll break it down to three points. First off, this is my first time. Second off, I did. I'm gonna here. Huh? I'm gonna here. No, you're the auntie. Second off, it looks really good. Like far away it's like okay like the straight brow kind of looks good like i think i can pull it off third off because it's my first time okay so guys yeah this is going to basically complete the finished look i'm gonna go surprise my family and ask them how they basically like see my eyebrows if they think that they're like cute or not if they look 
a mess. Sorry guys, there's like some background noise because family members are, um, they just arrived and came over. But anyways, guys, this is gonna conclude this tutorial. Um, okay guys, and this is the final finished look of the brow tutorial, okay? The Audrey Hepburn, Bella Hadid inspired brow, okay? Is it giving what's supposed to give? I hope so, period. Um, so, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this um, eyebrow makeup tutorial or whatever. And just make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and share this video. I will be posting the 1,000 subscriber giveaway either this at the end of this video or the next video or in the description box. But yeah, I do have a giveaway and I will announce it in my next video. Okay, so you guys can enter that and or I'll put it in the description. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, y'all.